Alrighty, so we're not even that far in. We're wave 12 now. And we're in the last upgrade for businessman Eugene. Uh, he's at 49.5k for yen placement. So, trades do affect their money. Like, if it's a money trade, it will affect how much they have. So, for your last upgrade for this, he probably will be doing over 50k if you have entrepreneur or uh, glitch or something like that that gives money. But, yeah, he's, his money is just insane. 50... 49k he doesn't give no buffs like oshi but the money is just yeah really insane so i'm gonna go all of them one at a time i don't have that much money but the wave should go by as we pass along so first upgrade for shadow commander it's gonna be 4.8k 4.82k 17 range 5.5 spa now we're gonna go sunjin Wu. And as you saw, he's still level 1, but his damage is now 11.9k instead of 11.2. So, I mean, he absorbs. So, this is, he's just going to be an interesting unit overall. His uh, circles is the same. Line stays the same, too. 21 range, 5.1 SBA. 5.5. And then 7 SBA. Already. Second upgrade. Boom. 13.2k. 20 range. 7 seconds. 6.95, 19, 5.5. I look like I should do one at a time. I should do one at a time. So you unlock your uh your first move at upgrade three, Shadow Frenzy, and he becomes a full AOE. Uh, very interesting, very interesting. So 5.5 seconds FPA, 5.5 seconds SPA. But you know, 22 range, 9.10. Okay, I'm gonna his damage is kinda low compared to like you feel me? Just off placement, but ugh, he may get better, who knows? Alrighty, next upgrade. 12.2k, 25 range, 5.5 SBA. Uh okay, he's a hybrid. Thank 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 the Lords. Okay, he's actually on the bus he's a hybrid off placement. Wait. Wait. You can only place one of him. What about Igoris? You can place two Igrises, okay. I'm just gonna sell this man and then replace him. Yeah, hybrid off placement, that's actually low key busted. And he costs 850, so you can't place him off placement, but uh, just get a little bit of money you can. But let's continue. Um, Your second move, Shadow Rift at upgrade 5. His damage kind of doubles around here, close. But he goes from a line to a cone. 23,000 damage with 50 range, 5.5 second SPA. His range is kind of good, I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of busted. Let's keep going. Boom, here. He's about to stop. So, this is uh, one upgrade before last upgrade. 32,000 damage, 60 range, 5.5 second SPA. SPA. Then, last upgrade, 43,000 damage. 70 range and 5.5 SPA. Now keep in mind, all of these units are level one besides Sun Jin Wu, so uh, yeah. But from what I know, my knowledge, this isn't very good. But then again, he is a bleed unit, so yeah. Uh, Jin Wu is a bleed unit too, so Avatar would probably be best for these bleed units since damage over time. Avatar and glitch, but I didn't get that lucky, so yeah. And 70 range is insane with the cone, too. That's honestly, yeah, that's actually pretty good. I'm not gonna lie to you. 70 range with cone, no range treat. Imagine like this with uh, all seeing, you may actually hit 100 range. I'm not gonna lie, this may be the only unit that's able to do that. Alrighty, and let me see there his effects, too. Unit VFX. Let me just sell, sell, hold on, give me a second. Wait, what's his cap? One, yeah, okay. I, I really want to see his effects, my bad. It's just lines, okay. Next unit we're going to do, we're going to save the best for last here. Next unit, Shadow Tanker. Hybrid off placement, 10.5k SPA. That's SPA. 10.5k damage, 20 range, 7 seconds. Boom. First upgrade. 
13.2k. Hold up. There we go. There we go. Wait, is this range too far now? It doesn't matter. Yeah, so, I'm going. 13.2k, 20 range, 7, let's see. Uh, the only thing that's really bad is his SPA, and it's starting to go down, so that's good, but we're going to see. You get your third, you get your first move at upgrade 3, and we're on upgrade 2, 18.7k, 22 range, 7 SPA. First move, he changes from a full AoE, which is kind of sad, but it's alright. Let's just see his attack effects again real quick. He So it's just a simple dash. 25,000 damage, sturdy range, 6 second SPA. We're going to go into the fourth upgrade now, 42,000 damage, sturdy range, 6 second SPA. Then we're going to go to fifth upgrade, 66,000 damage, 35 range, 6 second SPA. Then we get your last move. I think this is your second move. Boom. Let's see. So you keep the cone, and it's no longer a dash. It's like the spikes from Shadow Commander. But 72,000 damage, 40 range, 6 second SPA. Then last upgrade, 100k. Uh, 101k damage, 40 range, and 6 second SPA. And I'm not going to lie. I think Igris was like 60,000 or something. But then again, he had bleed. So Igris is looking probably better than this man's. I'm not going to lie to you, even though he's doing 100k. Agaris is probably most definitely better than him, but uh, I can't really say. He's a hybrid, right? Yeah, okay. Now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, boys. Sunjin Woo. Evo, double Evo, I should say. Secret with Overlord at level 34. So, upgrade zero. He has a lot of upgrades. See how expensive he is. Upgrade zero, 10.8k, 21 range, 5.1 second SPA. Uh, first upgrade, 29,000 damage, 21 range, 5.1 SPA. Second, 46,000 damage, 21 range, 5.1 SPA. Then we get our first move at upgrade three. Let's see what that is. So, circle stays the same. We keep that. Let me see the move effect. This is literally like a blast of some sorts. I want to see his first move effect. Let me see his first move effect. I'm gonna get him back. Hold on. Okay, so this is him slamming down with electricity. All right. So, 52,000 damage. 20 on range for 0.6 second. 4.67 second SPA. That's actually better. Not gonna lie. All over said. Upgrade four. 83,000 damage. 26.2 range, and then 4 second SPA. Next upgrade, we're hitting 100,000. This is looking pretty good. He's level 34, and he's already doing 100,000. So we're at 145k damage, 26 range, and 4.67 second SPA. Thorough, boys. Thorough, just let me tell you. Oh, wait. Hold on, wait. There's like a little thing that pops out of him. Uh, okay, that's that's kind of fire. I can't lie. So that's kind of fire. Alrighty. But, second move... On upgrade six, we're gonna just get right into it. Oh my god, full AOE. Just look at this man spaz out going crazy. So we go to 213,000 damage, 26.2 range, and 5.1 second SPA. His SPA went up a little bit more, but I'm okay for the full AOE. It may have been worth it. I'm not gonna lie to you. With the uh, bleed too, he should be bleed. I don't really know. Next upgrade. Twenty uh two hundred ninety K, twenty six point two range, five point one second SPA. And we're about to get our third move on upgrade eight. So I think it was three, six, and eight. This one's gonna be Shadow Tanker SPA does does go up, but his damage almost doubles in return. For like literally point eight seconds more. So let's just get right into it. Boom, upgrade eight. Full AoE once again. His attack effect changed and it's just like a strike down. Look, he looks thorough still. Well, 569k 
damage, 31 range, and then 5.97, 5.95 second SPA. His damage, everything just basically becomes better. His damage goes better, range, and uh, SPA goes down just to go back up, surprisingly. But anyways, it doesn't matter. We're about to unlock Shadow Commander move. Um, 742,000 damage, 42 range, 5.52 second SPA. Oh, we got the new move. It's a line. Well, this is Shadow Commander's move. Uh, okay, there is bleed. Okay, yeah, there's bleed. Yeah, bleed's kind of busted. But we are at nine hundred sixty-six thousand damage. Sixty-three range. Five point ninety-five second SPA. His SP goes up a bit more. But we're about to hit the millions at level thirty-four. Yeah, this mid's busted. And we have a rise. Now we're at 1.04 million damage, 63 second range. I said second, 63 range and 6.37 second SPA. And we now have a cone AoE instead of a line. So that's interesting. Let's see his moves now. It's back to dashing a little bit. Look, he just kind of fire. I'm about to wait for him to kill the boss. I'm going to use a rise real quick. A rise. And it's just literally just a whole bunch of running. I'm not gonna lie, mess with that. And it's a 40 second. Okay, so that's kind of that's Loki calm. Alrighty, we're gonna go to the next upgrade. Uh, there's no more moves, but this is just this damage increasing. 1.13 million damage, 63 range, and 6.37 second SPA. Now we're just gonna go to max. 1.21 million damage, 63 range, 6.37 second SPA. No skill tree, of course. So this could probably go down at three seconds. I'm not gonna lie, from what I'm seeing, he seems pretty busted. Uh, definitely a good unit, even with level, like, he has Overlord, of course, too, and he's level 30. He's still doing this much, like, let me use a Rise real quick. Oh my god, I didn't even get to see the effect last time. Use the ability Arise. Why is this kind of sexy? Arise. And then you can only place one, I'm assuming? Yeah. Well, I have Overlord. I have even a test, but this man is looking looky thorough. And as you can see, it says 1.25 million here and the 1.21 million. I think it's because of his little passive. So it's interesting. But let me just get a little uh, screen shot. Wait, I want to rise to come off cooldown real quick. Alrighty. Um, I'm gonna go from here to here. And to be honest, I don't even think he was that expensive, Loki. Like Loki. Let me see. He's nowhere near as expensive as this man's, at least. That man's expensive as crap. Like, let me pay some. Yeah, there's nowhere near that expensive. I never even looked at this man's full stats before. Anyways, this is a very long animation. Hmm. Interesting. Anyways, that'll be it for this video. As you guys saw the showcases, uh, that's Shang Jung uh, secret. And I'm really just about to post this video, and I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace.